Outdoors bound tonight. Big news concerning big bass at Smith Mountain Lake. George Noliff of WFXR's Outdoors Bound joins us now in studio. So George, what's the scoop? Stoney, we can't say big enough about this story. You know why? Well, because it is sort of a big deal. How y'all doing, folks? Largemouth bass are the most targeted freshwater sport fish in Virginia. We're talking almost a billion dollars a year in economic impact. Now, when it comes to the best places to fish for them, we've got one of those right here in our own backyard, Smith Mountain Lake. The Virginia Department of Wildlife Resources has been trying to make the bass fishery at SML even better by stocking Florida strain hybrids called F1s. A little bass you see right now, that's an F1. Now, an F1 may sound like a race car, but in this case, think semi-truck. Y'all probably know Florida strain largemouth bass are predisposed genetically to get gigantic. That's why I compared them to a truck. Turns out a lot of those babies are growing up, and the VDWR says there are now more four pound or larger largemouth bass at Smith Mountain Lake than there's been in a long time. More big bass at Smith Mountain Lake means more people taking the trip there to fish, and that translates into jobs and cash for the local economy. VDWR still taking a look at the numbers before declaring the Sagan program a success, but right now, it looks pretty good. That is some good news. I do have to ask you though, George, because yeah. speaking of the local economy, I want to ask you something kind of Christmas shopping related and fishing. Don't worry, I'm not going off the rails here. We're hearing about shortages, of course, nationwide. If people want to buy any fishing gear, guns, or anything else outdoors related, is there any type of shortage there, or is everything pretty much available? Uh, the short answer is yes, everything is available. Uh, whether it's rods, reels, kayaks, farms, tents, anything you use for outdoor activities, they are available, but and you knew there was a butt coming. Of course. You may not have the selection you had in years past at local stores. The easy way around that, if you can't find a specific gift, buy a gift card, give it to them, let them go back, you know, weeks, months later, uh -oh. and you know, they've got the gift. The other hint that I can give you, okay. shop local. These local guys, a lot of times they are under shopped, especially this time of year, and they may have things in stock that the big box stores don't have. So, uh, you know, you, you go there, you might find what you're looking for. Well, and also if you shop local, then the money stays in the The money area. stays local, and we like that. Yes, we do. Thank you, George.